What do we think about James O'Keefe? James O'Keefe is, is a hero. He's somebody who simply, you know, a hero isn't a god. A hero, a hero is somebody who's a common citizen who simply steps up when the opportunity arises. Right? The things, some of the things he showed tonight were not spectacular. Uh, getting uh, uh, um, lucky charms thrown out of the, of the the college. It was cute. It was funny. It was interesting. But was it a, a heroic thing? Yeah because he was a common man doing something uncommon. He talked about uh, ad hominem attacks on him rather than uh, addressing the actions. Uh, how, how common is that in uh, liberal culture? It, it's, there is nothing other than that because the liberal cannot argue fact and reason because he rejects the notion of fact and reason. The liberal believes that fact and reason is bigoted. Anything you learn, any fact you learn is bigoted by whoever it was who taught you and every reason that you have, every argument that you make is bigoted by your own prejudices. You can't have a thought that is not prejudiced by the fact that you're white, black, tall, short, rich, poor. So therefore, everything the liberal, every argument the liberal makes is an ad hominem attack. They have nothing else they can do. Seriously, name me a single issue, one, where the Democrats' argument is an affirmation of what it is they believe. There's nothing. Everything is, I'm right because I'm morally superior, and if you disagree, you're evil. And so their attacks then are, are directed towards the messenger rather than the message? Well, they can't attack the message because the message isn't, the message isn't wrong. All right, the message isn't necessarily, I, I don't argue ever, ever, that the Republican is always right. What I argue is that the Democrat is always wrong. And the reason he's always wrong is because he looks at what other people judge to be good and by definition says that judgment is bigoted. Therefore, I'm going to attack whatever it is he thinks is good. You know, we, we love to believe that liberals hate religion. They don't hate religion, they hate Christianity and Judaism. They love Islam. Why? If they hate religion, why? Because it's not religion. It's anything that society recognizes as good, they attack. Anything that society recognizes as bad, they defend. And let me quote a man who some people think is smarter than I am. I don't personally, but his name is Thomas Sowell. All right, He's, and Sowell said, this is how the liberal comes to his argument, that comes to his beliefs. That which is held in esteem qualifies to be their target. That which is held in disdain qualifies to be their mascot. Right? Judaism and Christianity, in the example I just gave, is held in esteem by good, decent, smart, loving Americans. Islam is held in disdain. So, they attack Judaism and Christianity and they elevate and hold as their mascot, Islam. Bush was held in esteem, they attacked Bush, but now that Obama's for the past, I don't know, five years in office, isn't he held in esteem and, and thereby a target? Well, it's not necessarily that he's held in esteem, he's not held in esteem by good, decent, loving, smart Americans, he's held in esteem by, by leftists, all right? But, the fact that he holds America in disdain, the fact that he has to go around the world apologizing for America, the fact that he has publicly stated America is not exceptional, and if America is not exceptional, how do we get so rich? It must be an injustice. Somehow our success, if we're not exceptional, must be a cosmic injustice. So Obama attacks America, weakens America, and I'll give you an example. It's supposedly because of the environment that we're not allowed to drill in the Gulf. But we will spend American taxpayer money to help the Brazilians drill off their coast. So if it's the environment, who has stricter environmental laws? All right, it's not about the environment. Liberals don't give a damn about the environment. Everything is a fig leaf for weakening America and strengthening everything that is evil, failed, and wrong. Everything.